Hi, I'm making um, curry shredded pork with steamed rice. I'm originally a Belizean by birth, lived in Texas for a long time and I used to make perfect rice in Texas. I moved home now roughly about just shy of five years or a little bit more. And I've been struggling for that amount of time to be able to cook my rice perfectly. Normally it would spoil me after a little while. And when I found out or figured out today that I was using too much water. I still put a little bit too much water in it today but I managed to salvage it. So I used kuhun oil, coconut oil, olive oil and I made um, six months back I made pork and beef steaks that I cooked slowly for a different meal and I ended up with um, this amazing fat that was uh, left over in the saucepan that I stored I've been using that for a while I use uh, one eight cup of that oil and that was the last the rice is perfect please like share and comment please um, it's basamante rice with olive oil, kuhun oil, coconut oil, and beef and pork fat, or larder oil, or whatever you want to say. I'm not even so sure what it is, but it's just the meat oil with um, a cup and a half of um, rice. And uh, the actual amount of water should have been two and a quarter. I actually went a little heavy and put a little bit more, more like two and three, um, almost two and a half, two five eighths. And now I have curry, uh, pork, sauteing in a curry based sauce with um, kuhun oil, olive oil, coconut oil and some pork fat from uh, two nights ago that I managed to save and salvage as well and use today and it's delicious. I tried it and it's super delicious so you can try it. What I did, I just put the pork meat in a crock pot and just let it cook for you know the time that it was needed to be cooked I mean I took it out put it up stored it and now I'm making a curry base sauce and it has a mean kick to it too please like share comment and subscribe to the channel hit the notification bell as well enjoy hope you will try it and I use root work ingredients to flavor it as well. Here I put pink Himalayan salt only. Oh, I can't wait to dig in.